Welcome back. This is uh, Cherry Blossom Girl. I just wanted to comment on things in, in the world again. I hope that you've seen my first video. If not, check it out, please. Um, I would like to, um, I guess, talk about why we all think that we are going to be famous. Um, this is in response to Anani Girl's uh, video. But she basically asked, why do people think that they're supposed to be famous? They're going to be big. Well, uh, the main point I would have is that we're told that we're special, whether by our parents or by people that love us or whoever. So that makes us feel good about ourselves. We feel good when we feel special. Um, you want that in anything. You want it in relationships. You want it in your workplace. You want it when you're at school trying to get grades. Good grades make you feel special. Uh, so, yeah, you want to feel special. And the ultimate thing that people think will make them feel special is if they're well-known and well-liked. Um, so if you look at the way we treat people like Angelina Jolie or, you know, Jennifer Lopez, Brad Pitt, or Christian Bale, a lot of people love these movie stars. And, and we treat them like they're God. You would so flip out if, if you ran into Angelina Jolie at the grocery store. But I doubt for one second that if any of you ran into me at a grocery store, you'd even bother to say hi. You don't know me. I don't know you. And the only way you've ever seen me is on YouTube. Maybe MySpace or Facebook or whatever. But the point is, it kind of makes you feel like like you're not special if nobody notices you. So, might I propose that instead of trying to feel special by becoming famous, that we look inside ourselves and try to find what's special about ourselves. I know personally, I study psychology, but I know I'm probably never going to be a world famous psychologist and come up with some sort of amazing theory about how this or that works. But I know that I want to be special by helping at least one person in their lifetime make a major change for the better. So let's just focus on having ourselves special paying attention to ourselves, loving ourselves. Um, that way we don't need to be validated by going on American Idol and winning the big grand prize um, or starring in the world's biggest blockbuster hit because those are things that pass with time. You know, really, who really re watches Titanic every day now, you know? Sure, you can recognize Kate Winslet and Leonardo DiCaprio, but after the dust of fame has settled, after the dust of success has passed, what do you really have? And a lot of these stars really just, they have a lot of problems because people won't stop photogra- like, taking pictures of them, sorry. So the people won't stop taking pictures of stars. Well, you can see that when you look at Britney Spears and Lindsay Lohan. And I definitely don't have anything really against them. I, I just see that their lives aren't really probably where, it sh where they should be. Um, and they probably are engaging in unhealthy behaviors. Um, please don't sue me. Uh, but I would say it, it doesn't seem like it would be that great to be a star. Like, it would be nice to have people love and respect you. Well, I guess love would be the word because I don't think anybody really respects stars. But 
At the end of the day, you have to find what's special about you. Cherish it and hold on to it for dear life. This is Cherry Blossom Girl signing off. I bid you do. I'll talk to you later, and I'll see ya. But remember, we can't all be famous. And who would want the cameras on us all the time anyway?